Hey guys, it's FIFA Rally here, and welcome to episode 15 of Let's FIFA 13. And as you can see here, Fry here did sell on, made me a few coins there, and one of my bronze badges sold on as well. So, got a few coins in there, and after that, I decided to go out and pick up a few contracts. I needed at least one in order to uh, get the contracts up on Akin Ferry because he was running out. So, we applied to him, and uh, we head on into the quarterfinals of the Gold Cup. I quickly changed the bench uh, to the Serie A Brazilian side uh, just so they will get their fitness up, and then I go into that quarterfinal coming up against the Russian league team with Kagawa in the side as well and it is me again the first chance in the 10th minute lovely stuff from Terrapt and the Rabona to get it over the line 1-0 it is and straight from his kickoff I will actually pick the ball up and uh, I will go on the attack here it's Eto on the ball I believe he panics the defender somehow here he goes past the keeper I try for a little fancy finish and in the end it's Terrapt getting the goal I had hoped the ball would have gone in, but Trap kind of locked onto it, but still a pretty good goal, and it's 2-0, and we keep on creating chances, trying with a bicycle kick there, but it goes over the goal, Trap on the ball here, nice stuff, finds Sazaidi, we take out the keeper, try for the Rabona once again, but the angle was way too narrow for me to get the goal, 42nd minute, it is a toe on the ball, he makes his way into the box, and you see one of his defenders getting a hamstring there, so uh, I believe his players did not have the, the full fitness before the game, and I actually end up picking up a penalty as well. It took his steps up for that and he will convert it to make it a 3-0. So looking very, very good in the quarterfinals and we continue into the second half. Here it's uh, Mario Fernandez on the ball. Lovely stuff. We try to cross it in but a relatively easy save for his keeper. And then McGeady's turn to get on the ball. Some very nice stuff here. Goes past one defender. He will take on a second one as well. Make his way into the box. Takes on a third one and puts it into the side net to make it a 4-0. What a game that was. I win it and I move on through into the semi-finals a very fun game to play and I will change squad I'll go with the Serie A Brazilian side for that game and then uh, we come up against the squad which is not too bad. Almost a full Chelsea side apart from Mbia, Rafael and Valencia. And it's me again the first chance here with Elgerson. Nice stuff to go past two defenders. Takes the shot but a check will save that one. And then in the 30th minute I will break through and this time around Elgerson will get the goal. He takes out the keeper. 1-0 it is. And we continue into the second half. Here it's Lamella on the ball. We pick up the 15th penalty and we are kind of caught up with a number of episodes as well. And I guess uh, from the next episode on I will try and count in the, the penalties I miss as well because I know someone would like to see that so I'll try and include that as well but as you can see that he gets back into the game with Torres but just one minute after I break through to make it a 3-1 and we get another chance Lamella on the ball finds Ronaldinho who will run a little bit of circles around Ramirez here out on the wing lovely stuff goes past him a few times makes his way into the box I went a little bit too far tried out the fake drag back and he will tackle it away but here uh, he will throw it badly out it goes to to his player but I pick it up straight away with Congo pass it to Ronaldinho and this time around he gets the goal to make it a 4-1 another game with 4 goals in uh, from, my, from my side and um yeah, I move on through into the final. Not too bad there. And we'll play that game as well uh, to see if we can pick up the trophy and the 2,000 coins. And we go into the game with the Serie A Brazilian side. Come up against a very strong uh, mix of Bundesliga and Premier League players. It's me getting the first chance here with Elgerson getting a shot in. But it hits the post. And then I had the chip on the rebound there because I was trying to change player. But nonetheless, I will get a goal here in the 18th minute. But 10 minutes later, he plays a through ball down the wing. He will cross it in and I felt my defender should have had that ball but Robin will get the goal to make it 1-1 but just in the same minute I will actually break through with Lamella to make it 2-1 get it back in the lead instantly and in the 40th minute I get another chance Pato on the ball had hoped for a volley but it bounces up and he ends up heading it out into a quite easy save for the keeper so at half time it is 2-1 and we continue into the second half and we had only played 4 minutes and then I find Lamella a little scoop to him past the defender he gets his second goal off the game there and it's a 3-1 but he will also get a goal here uh, through ball down the wing once again he will cross it in and it's Robin once again is scoring off a header 3-2 it is but I'll of course be looking to get that uh, 2 goal lead and I get it here with Elkerson a quite nice goal uh, first time flicker while he kind of run into the ball 
and then a first time volley looked pretty good and then we get one final chance lovely play from Mjolnir you're finding part so we go past two defenders here and a sideways volley almost going in could have been a very very nice goal and 90th minute Pato is on the ball once again taking a shot but it goes just wide so another game with four goals for me and then uh, we win the final we get the the trophy coins and it is not too bad there and as you can see um, the inform Janssen so long he only made me about 1k profit after tax but still it's all right it's some coins and we got around a 40k coins now so I'm aiming to to slowly build my up uh, way towards those 100k so uh, I actually uh, can build a new squad because it would be cool to have a bunch of squads at the same time but maybe I'll sell on some of the older squads as well we'll see but uh, yeah I go out and pick up a few bronze packs because I want to get some contracts for my, for my bronze squad and uh, meanwhile I did that I actually got them um, the possibility to unlock a new pack so that is not too bad I will make my profit back I get a rare manager there meaning I get a per percentage modifier to the contracts and uh, yeah we list up a few items we get the commentary kit I believe it is which looks quite a bit like the Brazil uh, kit when you play in game so uh, I check the price it only goes for 200 coins I'd hope for a bit more but still it will sell on and make me a few coins and then we go into the bronze nations cup and uh, we get the first chance in the game here with a little bicycle Kick, but pretty easy to save for the keeper and then into the second half where most of the chances were we find Kratau here through on goal he will take the shot and that is a 1-0 and just one minute after a nice play here Rodjic on the ball a few skill moves here to go past the defenders takes the shot but it is saved by the keeper but he would get on the ball again I'll have to say Rodjic is an awesome bronze player look at this shot once again scoring from distance and He's an amazing bronze player, probably like in the future linking him up with Ben Sia, try them together in a squad because they're both really, really good bronze players. But yeah guys, that is all for this episode, I hope you did enjoy it, I'll have another one out tomorrow, and that's all, thank you for watching, and I will talk to you later.